hot flashes are caused by a thermal dysregulation that's occurring in the brain due to estrogen deficiency. And so lots of women will experience all different grades and quality of hot flashes and night sweats. So some people will just experience heat intolerance where they feel like, you know, they need some fresh air, it's hot, they're uncomfortable. Other patients will describe actual hot flashes where there's a heat building from, you know, either their chest or their face and, and go moving upwards, they're getting red, they're breaking out in a sweat. When estrogen is deficient, it causes a dysregulation between your internal body temperature from a brain standpoint into your actual temperature gauge. And so you do start to see vasoconstriction, not dilation, until you go through the full course of that flushing event. So you're basically seeing the estrogen drop causing the brain and body temperature to actually not become regulated. So think of it as your thermostat that all of a sudden stops functioning. Either it loses battery and it, and it just plummets when you're cold, right? Or it is served too much power and now is surging your temperature and that's exactly what's happening with estrogen brain function wise so when estrogen is fluctuating and especially up and down and mostly when estrogen is deficient patients are having thermoregulatory dysregulation where that thermostat is not regulated anymore and so it's just going to surge body temperature and then you're going to get the hot sweat event